What's up, y'all? This is The Brain, and this is DBFM Entertainment. DBFM Entertainment. Ah! DBFM Entertainment. The Brain is for show, man. The Brain is for show, man. DBFM Entertainment. What's going on, y'all? It's The Brain from DBFM Entertainment. First official day of winter. So this is the first opportunity to get out and ride the fat bike. Now I know it's not much snow. I mean, you can see the grass underneath. But it's still snow. All right, we're finally here at Beulah. Time to get that first winter ride in. There's definitely been someone else out here this morning, today, sometime. Man, it's good to be back at Eula. It's been a while. In fact, I don't think I've ridden here since I got the uh, derailleur and the cassette replaced. Yeah, that's right. That was the last time I rode it because I broke it here. So I've never ridden in snow before. Well, at least not trail riding or on the fat bike. So I really don't know what to expect as far as grip and all that. So I'm just kind of taking it easy at first. Get my bearings. Sliding out. Let's check out this trail. It's one of my favorite ones here. I wish I charged up my battery fully before I came here. So if I haven't mentioned already, when I came home from Cattle Moraine and John Murr on Sunday, about 20 minutes away from home, I started getting a warning light in the car saying that it couldn't charge the battery. So I was thinking, okay, well, mechanic is just by my work. I'll just bring it to them Monday morning when I go there. And I took the wrong turn. Nope, that way. So I drive to work, drop off all my stuff, get in the car to take it down the street. Car dies. Luckily, I still have the bike in the car <laughs> with a relatively charged battery. I mean, I had just put 25 miles on it, but that'd be enough to get me, that'd be enough battery life to get me to seven miles home. So I go home, I have to ride my bike home, the next day I ride it back, because they still held my car, and there were like 40 mile an hour winds, sub-freezing temperatures, and I'm pedaling like, pedaling like head into the wind the whole way. That was awful. So basically I've got seven hard miles on this battery. Let's follow this guy's path. Maybe he's a local. Yeah, I don't want to slide and fall there. This place looks so much different now. No 
of trees you can actually see. I mean, look at this. I can see most of the trails here. It's pretty cool. It's my first time seeing this park like this. I've only been biking for less than a year, so I haven't seen all the seasons here yet. Late spring, summer, and fall. It's the first time I've seen winter. Oh no. Almost. Should have committed. If I didn't slide right there, I would have ran over that dog poo. Lucky me, huh? Oh shoot, the climb's coming, isn't it? Shucks. broke my derailleur. Let's hope we don't do that again. This is one of my favorite trails here. Once it gets along the river. Top of the jump lines, huh? my favorite run in the world and I had no experience. Still a good run. A lot of trees down. I bet you this all happened in the windstorm we had the other day. Probably the day that I was riding to work. Now that I think about it. I'll tell you what, changing GoPro batteries. So inconvenient. All you want to do is keep your hands nice and warm. No, battery's dead. Gotta change it, bruh. And you gotta keep the batteries warm. That way, replacement batteries don't lose the charge too quick. All right, man, I'm taking your life away. And we're back. It's about 24 degrees out here. I got about three bars left in the battery out of five. It's been pretty fun, actually. The tires aren't doing too bad. I'm definitely gonna replace them because they're just the cheap tires that came with it. I've never even heard of this brand. CST, what is it? CST BFT. Don't tell me what the hell that means. So I'm probably gonna put a winter set on soon, but we're just getting the first ride and we're just gonna try it, see how it's going and move on from there. Yeah, this part. Nope. 
wasn't feeling that one. What do I want to do? I'll take the end trail. I haven't been on this one yet. Afraid to lean the bike. It's pretty slippery. So I want to whip it around some of these corners. Oh, this will be so much fun. This is going to be so much fun when there's four or five inches of powder. Oh. <laughs> I was waiting for the first one. Well, and I guess my thumb was probably on it. Damn. Let's see if I can see if I can still kind of cheat it. No. <laughs> oh yeah, no way. Damn, that sucks. No, I actually gotta do work. I wonder, is there some way I can fix that? Not, uh, not readily. It's just a lever. All it does is rotates this piece. I can still kind of cheat by just moving my legs and just telling the motor to kick in. This should be a pretty good comparison of how much fun I was having. <laughs> the back wheel sliding out. So I only got it in pedal assist level three right now. The pedal assist is too jerky on level five. That is if I'm pedaling and not just throttling. So much torque. But this will do. I'm almost to the exit anyway. I got my fun in. I knew I should have ordered two throttles last time I bought one. And that's that. Now let's get home. It's my throttle. Yeah, I need to always have two on hand. One in the backpack, one at home. <laughs> it's funny how that completely changes this bike. Right now, I'm definitely on a bike. With the throttle, this becomes motocross. Light motocross. But still, same thing. Just standing on this bicycle thing, just being propelled by a motor. All right, cool, so, kind of learned what the bike could do today in the snow, light snow. 
Also got a good crash video. That's cool. Why did I have to break that, man? At least it didn't break the gimbal mount again. So just taking this path south, it's gonna get me back home. Yo, thanks for checking out this video. Glad you enjoyed it. Stay subscribed so you can get all the latest videos. Definitely gonna put some more winter fat bike videos up. Hopefully get some deep powder and start shredding, y'all. Again, thanks for watching. This is The Brain. This was DBFM Entertainment.